great fun original production. Please sit back and enjoy. Hey guys, Dread Fun here with another one of my video uploads. Uh, this time I'm drawing the legend Lou Ferrigno. That's right, uh, all six foot five, two hundred and eighty five pounds of them. Uh, a while back I got a, a really nice request for a trio of bodybuilders. Uh, I did surge, and now it's time for Mr. Lou. Uh, uh, yeah, a lot of fun doing this drawing. Uh, if you don't know anything about Mr. Lou Ferrigno, uh, of course he was a Mr. Universe. Uh, everyone uh, remembers him from Pumping Iron. Uh, coming in thir third behind Serge Nebre and Arnold Schwarzenegger. A lot of people don't realize that in 1977 he also competed in the World's Strongest Man, uh, came in fourth in that event, so not only a great physique, but also a powerful individual. And then, for me personally, uh, Lou Ferrigno, wow, I mean the Hulk. As a kid, I used to run home to watch, uh, to watch the TV series and to see Banner change into the Hulk every week, and... Uh, I was so inspired by it that, uh, like I said, I actually I ripped up my clothes once and took uh, green food coloring and smeared it all over my skin trying to be the Incredible Hulk and do the old most muscular pose like uh, Lou Ferrigno. So as a young boy, he was a huge inspiration to me and the visual that I have with uh, big powerful physiques and my own weightlifting uh, uh, hobby or career or whatever you want to call it. But, uh, yeah, so this was a lot of fun to do. Um, Lou Ferrigno, uh, he, he was uh, the IFBB Mr. Universe in 1973 and 74. He was also the uh, NABBA Mr. Universe in 1972. Uh, same title name, two different organizations. Uh, back then, one had a little more respect than the other. Um, yeah, a while back, he competed in the Masters and the Mr. Olympia, and was I believe he weighed like almost 300 pounds, if not over. So, I mean, he, he's another one of those, like Serge Nebre, being able to compete for a prolonged uh, stretch, and not only, a, you know, a great actor. So, yeah, doing it in my pencil realism style, uh, where I'm focusing on taking an image that I have off to the side. Uh, I've done some measurements, and I know where I'm going to place everything, and I just do a, a sort of, it almost equates to a rough outline. You see it at the start of the drawing. I uh, basically just have everything measured off to the side, and I know what that shape is going to look like and then uh, you'll see very quickly I bring the ruler in and out to uh, to make sure that I've got the, the dimensions exactly right and then I focus a lot on the shading using a single uh, pencil I don't mess around with other pencils I just use my mechanical uh, my old mechanical pencil so it's a lot of fun to do and I, I hope you guys like this and if you know Mr. Ferrigno uh, send it to his Facebook maybe we can uh, get him to like this video too Dread Fun out this has been a DreadFun.com production. Thanks for watching.